welcome to Callum Connects, five minute entrepreneurial inspiration for your day. Today on Callum Connects, we're joined by Deborah Muth. Deborah is the founder and CEO of Serenity Healthcare Center and 15K a day doc. She's an entrepreneur and has been a healthcare expert for more than 23 years. A hurdle I faced as an entrepreneur. I remember sitting outside my office door and I just couldn't go in anymore. I couldn't go in to deal with the stress of every day again. Patients complaining, staff complaining, everybody wanting something from me and me feeling like I had nothing left to give. I was so empty inside from working so many long hours and giving to everyone that I never had time to refill my own cup. So I remember sitting there saying, I'll perceive today to be different and it'll have to be different. Perception is everything. Except I walked through the door and there I was again in the stress of the everyday grind of owning a business, figuring out when you're going to have the time to take care of all the growth and the branding and the marketing, figuring out how I'm going to pay the bills today. How am I going to satisfy this client or that client or this staff member or that staff member? It just was so overwhelming to me. So I decided at that moment that I was going to figure out how to sell my practice. And everyone around me told me, Deb, there's no way you're ever going to sell this practice for what it's worth. Even though it was profitable, we had thousands of patients in our practice. They said, you'll never be able to sell this practice. So I set out on a mission to figure out how I could align my practice to be sold for what it was worth, not what it looked like it was worth on paper and what everyone was used to buying practices for, but what it was actually worth to me and what I needed to get from it. And along the way, what I found is I could sell my practice and I could earn a pension from the practice at the same time. And that was the most amazing thing for me because I knew I needed to work. I hadn't set myself up to a place where I set enough aside for retirement. So I needed income to feed my retirement. I still wanted to work a little bit. I just didn't want to do it all myself. So I set up and designed my practice with a pension And at the end of the time that I want to work, whether it be 10 years or 15 years, I'm going to exit that practice with a nice hefty pension that will take care of me and my family for the rest of our lives. Doing this has been so amazing for me because it's really taught me how I can teach other people to do the exact same thing, how they can design their business with a pension in mind find a person that wants to purchase their practice so they can work as long as they want to within that practice without having to worry about their financial situation. This has been the most amazing thing for me to be able to identify and teach. It's freeing. It's it's taken me from sitting in that parking lot that day and saying, I can't go in to saying, wow, I love my practice again. I love my business again. And I can help other people love their business and their practice the same way that I love mine. And in the end, we all win. My clients have someone to take care of them when I want to walk away. My employees have someone to work for when I want to walk away. I have a financial backing when I'm ready to walk away. And I can work as little or as much as I want to for as long as I want to and not have everything depend solely on me as a sole entrepreneur. And it is inspiring and amazing and wonderful again. The biggest hurdle I faced was when the company my partner and I built from scratch came under attack and more than a quarter of a billion dollars of value was destroyed. If you would like to learn more about that and how I came back from it, sign up at callumlang.com.